really depends on where you are today and over the coming few days but if you want to get out and about this week I think for many of us we can promise a good deal of dry weather that it'll be pleasantly warm with light winds in the summer sunshine but there will be some areas seeing cloudier spells at times with some showers or some rain. Lack of rain though for some parts of Eastern Europe of course where we've had the flooding the Ukraine and Poland today but still some showers plaguing Romania, Bulgaria. High pressure should keep most places down to the Black Sea fairly dry in the next couple of days but we will see showery rain developing say through Germany and parts of Austria but hopefully for just a couple of days. Now back home it's not a straightforward situation this is the view in Oxford where through the morning we have had some heavier pours of rain but we see a little bit of brightness breaking through the clouds right now. That's because this patch of rain is developing and edging northwards. So yes, it'll plague parts of southern England for the next few hours and then develop across the Midlands through the afternoon, perhaps giving us some heavier downpours. And to the east of that, where it's brighter as well, we could see some quite hefty thunderstorms developing. Here's an eye view out the window here in London, for example, where it is quite pleasant and quite warm still. But by far the best of the dry and bright weather is further west today. Northern Ireland, western Scotland, western parts of England and Wales, much drier and brighter than yesterday, just the odd heavy shower developing. Much better if you're trying to dry the washing, for example, and pleasantly warm in the sunshine, 20 or 21, whilst in the southeast, of course, still quite sticky. Now, although we lose that humid air over the coming few days, as you can see, it does stay quite warm, 20 to 25 degrees, generally speaking, across the country, indicating we will see some pleasant sunshine. But as we pick up on that rain through this evening and overnight, it will trek northwards through Lincolnshire into the northeast of England. Elsewhere, a little bit of fog forming again as we had this morning and some showers in Northern Ireland. But for most, a fairly comfortable night if you're trying to sleep, whilst we still hang on to that humidity in the south and the east. But a better prospect here, I think, tomorrow is some bright weather. Once the fog clears, we'll have that showery rain nudging its way across into eastern Scotland through the middle part of the day, breaking up to showers further south. Just one or two sharp showers around, but on the whole, a lot of dry Fine weather, pleasantly warm too. We'll have lost the humidity in East Anglia and the southeast by then. And a fairly pleasant day on Wednesday too, although by then I think we are likely to see rather more cloud for parts of Northern Ireland.